Caelan, one all at Stockport points a good result. Could you have had more though? Um, yeah, just um, decision making in the last like, half an hour um, made us get the draw. But yeah, we've had more chances to um, win the game. Uh, we've had Max's header, which could have easily went in. So yeah, we could have got a lot more from that game. Great start. You've been struggling away from home, but to take the lead after seven minutes gave everyone a lift, I think. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, from the sideline, the play that led up to the goal was brilliant. And then Greg to get that header it gives us a massive lift. For yourself, obviously back in action, and I'd imagine it's a massive relief. Yeah, I've been out for a month now. Well, got called a bit earlier than expected with halves going down injured, which is a bit unfortunate. But um, yeah, getting back into it. Just want to play as many games as I can now. The key, presumably, at the start of the second half was to keep things tight, but you didn't quite manage it. Yeah, as I say, it um, just comes down to decision making. We're going to learn from it, and yeah, it shouldn't happen again. But the plus point is, at the end, the last 10 minutes you were under pressure, but you withheld it, which you haven't been doing over yeah. previous away games. Yeah, it shows shows a lot of character in our team. About about the start of the season, towards only about three, four games ago, yeah, we probably would have thrown that away, but showing a lot more character in the last few weeks and it's looking better. And how is her? It looked a, a bad one straight away. Yeah, um, I haven't spoke to him yet, um, but I'm sure he'll get updated with how he is, but yeah, it looked a bad one from the side. And um, for yourself, obviously having sat out for a month, you've been powerless to do anything about the, the run that the team have been on. It's not been too spectacular at times. I think you got injured at Darlington and it's been a while. There's been quite a few games in that period. Yeah, um, it's it kind of had a good chance to have a look from the from the stands and things like that, see how we're playing. So having a look what I can bring to the team coming back from my injury and hopefully I can do that with the games coming forward. And I think the team have demonstrated that with players coming back from injury, you're not as bad as some people would have you made out to be. You, you could still be a force this season. Yeah, of course. Like, as I say, this is a good point away from home, in front of a big crowd. Um, we go to uh, Alpherton on Tuesday, like in positive mind. So we're looking to get the three points at home. And I know the message before the game was that Bradford would become an even better result if you could follow it up, which you've done. Yeah. This probably now becomes an even better result if you can get another win on Tuesday yeah, night. Yeah, like if we win at Alpherton, I'd take that as a, a good three games and in quick cons concession as well. So, yeah, if we get um, the three points on Tuesday, that's backing it up and that will give us a bit of a roll going, going on to the next games. Just final word on the FA Cup next weekend, it's Kirby Muxlow as a... Leicester lad, it's a nice local game for Yeah, you. literally, it's only about 15 minutes away from me, so I'll make sure I can get my rest and the rest of the Leicester lads, and I um, can inform the rest of the lads what Kirby are like, so yeah. It's a great, to... great tie on paper, but presumably the lads have got to just avoid any complacency and, and deal with it as you've done today, yeah, coming to a it. ground with yeah. 2,500 fans here. Yeah, we take um, that game as any, any other. We go looking for the win. Um, yeah, so I'm sure we'll get the to the next round. And I know from chatting to you a few weeks ago you had a good cup run at Corby a couple of years ago, you got to the first round. Yeah. Presumably with only three wins required that's got to be the aim. Yeah, first round for most non-league teams is the aim because the atmosphere, everything that comes with the first round, even the TV coverage, it, it does make it a lot more, more um, enjoyable and things like that. Looking forward to that game.